Hello everybody, how are you? Today is 5-17-2015, Sunday. I'd like to go over something from the Telegraph. Just how many incursions into NATO airspace has Russia uh, made? Basically we know since about September of 2014, Russia stepped up its, its flights and violations into the uh, channels and everything around England and Europe. This basically just goes over all the individual details as you can see. There's been a lot. UK airspace going this way, around Norway, Sweden, Estonia, Finland, Russia. Uh, this is some. This is uh, around the RAF uh, Lousemouth, RAF uh, Koningsby around France there's been bombers spotted and vessels RAF tycoons have scrambled to intercept two Russian long-range bombers off northern Scotland Wednesday its latest series of provocative operations into the country's air uh, or by the country's air force tension between NATO and Russia have worsened since the Ukraine we know about this I'm just going to get into something fun. Uh, Russia's Tu-95 Bear Bomber, strategic bombers capable of carrying the nukes, have been probing flights into the UK airspace about once a month. Ministry of Defense says Russian bombers have never violated Britain's sovereign airspace, which extends 12 nautical miles from the coast and publicly regards them as more of a routine nuisance than a threat. This is good. At least they know their uh, their bo their borders and their boundaries. But defense officials have expressed mounting concern over the nature of the flights. Michael Phelan, uh, the then defense secretary, said appearance of bear bombers over Channel in February, which I believe I put up a video about, marked the first time they have been seen in the area since the height of the Cold War. And basically, they scrambled jets very quickly to see them off. And they did that basically for their protection and everyone else's. Let me see any of the major comments here. One second, let me get down to the comments. Here we go, comments. Uh, Luke Durasco says they're probing for weakness. Uh, so he said, between your ears, I don't think it's happening at all. And this one saying, uh, this one from Michael Peters is saying, during the height of the Cold War, the bombers were from Ukraine, Moldova, Belarus, Georgia, Kazakhstan, and any of the Baltic states. It's a huge mistake to compare Russia with the Communist Soviet Union. They're not the same and do not have the same ideology. You're right. Russian soldiers are quitting, families are not being executed. These are not the same people. Uh, this one from Ice Inc. says, Ministry of Defense says the Russian bombers have never violated Britain's sovereign airspace. Just two old Soviet era uh, Turp uh, Russian planes fly once a month toward the English Channel. The aforementioned has uh, knee conservatives frothing at the mouth. Priceless. Just reading as it's written. Dave says, so can you now put up the number of daily illegal overflights of Russian, indeed Soviet airspace since the uh, Bear U-2 Blackbird flights, which goes on. While well, the Soviet Union sent its special forces to work as troops in the West to learn about their targets, we sent armed military units. Um, the NATO plan was always. All right, so. Again, 
This is coming from the Telegraph. It's just how many incursions in the airspace has Russia made. And as you can see, here's the URL. Uh, I'm going to that back and get the page that I'm seeing here.